Hello there guys, it's Phantom and QuickVid. Today I'm gonna show you how to eliminate buffer bloat on your internet connection using OpenWRT. So, let's go! <laughs> oh, that's hot! That's hot! First of all, go to your favorites with the site. I recommend fast.com. Then go to settings before starting. You check this box, check this two box, measure load latency during upload, and always show all metrics. So save and do a speed test. No, God, please, no, 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 no. Okay, now this is done. Take note wa how fast your internet speed is. In my case, this is 21, but I know my, my upload is 5 Mbps, so ignore it's 4.5, but I know mine is 5 Mbps, so ignore. Now go to your OpenWRT and go to system, software, then you hit update list. Okay, now that's all done. We need to go search for Lucy app dash SQM. Find and install. Yes. Now that's all installed. Now go here. Network. If it doesn't show up here, go back to home. So home overview. Then now you should see SQM QoS on network settings. Now that we're here, we need to configure what our downloads and upload speed is. So in my case, we get 21 Mbps. So this is correct. And upload, I know for a fact that I have 5 Mbps because currently I have uploading something right now. So this is 4.5. But let's set it 5 here. So set it to 2100 because 2100 kbps is 21 mbps. Then 5, 5 mbps, 5000 kbps for 5000 mbps here. Then um, next you go, just save this, save this for a while. Then Q, we, by default this is FQ Codel, but we'll choose cake. Then Q setup script should be piece of cake. Then save. Then link layer adaptation. If you have VDSL like mine, set set this, then set it to 8 bytes. If you're on fiber, just set it to none. So save. Then we go back to basic settings, enable, and save and apply. Now, after that's all done, we go back to fast.com and do a speed test once again. Nice. And would you look at that? That loaded latency. It's damn nice. Ah, even with uploads, our loaded latency is still under control, which is nice. Now we have successfully eliminated buffer bloat. Here's a speed test before and after. See the loaded difference? It's huge. And that's how you eliminate buffer bloat using OpenWRT. So, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, please Hit that like button and subscribe to my channel because that helps me a lot. And share this to your friends if you know you someone who, lo who loves stuff like this. So that's all for now and thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay at home, wash your hands and adios.